covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. The results of a major exploration mission showed Monday that the dwarf planet Ceres, long believed to be a barren space rock, is an ocean world with reservoirs of seawater beneath its surface. Maria Cristina, Cristina de Santi from the National Institute for Astrophysics in Italy says of the discovery, I'm extremely excited to find some evidence of liquid water, together with the fact that this body has a lot of minerals, very interesting for the formation of life. It's a good combination of chemical compounds that help in forming biological molecules. De Sancti and her colleagues analyzed high-resolution images in Sarah's, of Sarah's taken by the Dawn spacecraft, which orbited the dwarf planet between 2015 and 2018 before it ran out of fuel. In its final phase, the spacecraft orbited just 35 kilometers above the surface of Ceres, focusing on the Ocator Crater. She and her team were able to identify salt by comparing data, including images and spectral analysis, from the Dawn spacecraft with equivalent analysis of chemicals here on Earth. Earlier observations of bright deposits on the crater had hinted at the presence of salty water underneath. But the discovery of hydrated sodium chloride provides much stronger evidence of an underground ocean. Impact fractures on the surface of the Ocator crater analyzed in a separate study suggest the ocean is some 40 kilometers below the surface, although the exact size is unknown. It's pretty large, says De Sancti, adding that the presence of such a large body will certainly have influenced the geology of Ceres with water coming up from below the surface and bringing minerals with it. Ralph Jaumann of the Free University of Berlin in Germany says, the mineralogy is unique and so far not observed on other solar system bodies. Jaumann says these findings demonstrate that even small bodies like Ceres could have water in their interior. Thank you.